Hello and welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge, and we will be underway. And our live game is Burnley against Arsenal. I'm Peter Drury, and I'm joined in the commentary box by the familiar figure of Jim Begley. Well, thanks, Peter. There's a great sense of anticipation in this stadium. I've been hit by it too. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? It has to be the Chilean, Alexis Sanchez, one of the hardest grafting attacking players I've ever seen. He's strong, we're trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Timely intervention. Appearance and very necessary. How about it? It's there! That's no fluke, it's what he was there for. Our players like this fella almost have a sixth sense to get themselves in such great poaching positions. How quick-minded was that? Burnley take the lead, 1-0. Yeah, and then... Giroud, his first half strike gave his side the lead in his last outing. Giroud unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Passes it through. Joey Bach. Three. Vokes. Looks to slip it through. Managed to get it away. It's a good run down the left-hand side. Battles to win it back. Oops. Ramsey hurtles into the tackle. Hoists it high. Brady. Aim forward. The first 45 minutes are up. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front end for the half-time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. Burnley, happier of the teams, heading in for half-time, 1-0 up. Whistle goes, and we start the second half. Burnley, a real one-goal lead into the second half. Lovely feet. 12 blocks, and back out it comes. Folks, with the ball through. Arsenal have a sub ready to come on. And she just stood firm. Cazorla. Mesut Ozil produced a good ball to find Mesut Ozil, who couldn't get his shot away. Pulls out once more. And it's Shaka. Arsenal, their manager to thank for the last result. Well, Peter, he was lauded by the media, and quite rightly too. I think what he did was clever and decisive, and it just goes to show how tactically astute he is. Arsenal have opted to really stretch the game now. Yeah, that's pretty evident, but what's their thinking? Um, I, it looks as if the opposition are happy to defend the width of the 18-yard box, trying to remove that compactness. Who's ball? Who's going to get there? Well, the idea was crafty, but the weight of the pass was just a little light. Mustafi. Defending was strong and firm. They got the only goal to give them a 1-0 lead. To four. Well back. To four. Well played, he saw that coming. Now it's well back. That's good defence, uh, plain and simple, good defence. They refuse to allow a nicely measured pass. Oh, 
Oh, surely that deserved better. Yeah, the ball in there was simply superb. He won't be too happy that it's gone to waste like that. Granit Xhaka. And it's Welbeck. Defoe gets it back. Burnley are on the verge of a pretty special win. But they've got some hanging on to do here. Good, strong hand by the keeper. Shoots! That's surely a foul free kick. Burnley presented with the perfect chance here to open up their lead. The ball's come loose and the chase is on. Barton. Keeps everyone guessing. Granit Xhaka battles to win it back. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Gabriel. And the referee brings it to a close. What a game. End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. Look, it's a very fine win, but for me, the defence has been terrific in holding on to that lead. I think we're just about out of time. Many, many thanks to Jim, and a very good afternoon.